And the point that I want to pull from Pravesh's comment here is that a life coach is not an expert on life. So that's one thing you need. If you're going to take something else away from today, a life coach is not an expert on life. They are just trained. If they if they invested in themselves, they invest themselves into a, a, a course through certification and really put time into becoming a coach, then what a life coach has is they've got the skills, the knowledge, the tools, and some experience to bring into those coaching sessions um, to help you get to where you want to be. They're not an expert in life. I think it's important to be a good listener. It's important to, to be able to ask the right questions, to read body language, and to really understand and resonate with your client. And sometimes that takes you to also follow your intuition. Um, Paul, I would go, um, you must know your ethics. Um, you must be supportive. You must have patience. Most of all, you must have awareness. Because if you don't have awareness, you're not going to be able to help your the person you're coaching to be aware of their behaviors, their thoughts, their emotions, um, and their beliefs and their values. And people who are really empathetic, it's really important to be that person who observes and doesn't absorb. Because I think I have learned this the hard way when initially I started out, it was very difficult to really not absorb the feelings of someone else and really act as an observer. And one of the things that we're going to introduce over the next couple of weeks is a coaching clinic. So this is going to be a donation based coaching clinic love to start off with but at the same time the other thing we're going to be bringing in is this training course to really build and help people become life coaches and become a coach in minds.